right, now I've got, what do they call this, the Y trolley, I think, is that right? Yeah, the Y trolley. Um, I've got the Y trolley assembled now. Pretty much right off the bat, I had to take all of these black pieces here um, to my drill press and drill out or ream out the holes a little bit to be able to take the, what do they call them, M3? Yeah, M3 by 16 millimeter bolts. Uh, they weren't going to fit. And the little hexagonal or hexagon shaped um, holes that were 3D printed into these these three parts were too shallow and too big. It didn't really hold the nut. So again, I pulled out the uh, 7.30 seconds nut driver. And I think there might be some millimeter equivalent. And of course the uh, Allen wrench and tightened those down. Um, when I got to the, the belt holder here, I had to use a pair of pliers. You need those. Um, just to be able to hold on to them. It didn't say in the video, however, uh, looking at the picture in the video, it hinted, it was dark in their video, that the opening of the belt, opening of the belt points to the two bearing holder or away from the uh, single bearing holder side. So, something to keep in mind. Uh, otherwise, this part is now complete, and I'm going to keep moving on. Um, I do know at some point I have to snap, uh, that's what it shows in the picture, snap these over the bearings. That should be interesting. I don't, I have my doubts, but we will see. I'm not trying to uh, speak ill of uh, Folger Tech just yet, uh, but we will see. All right. I'm moving on to the next project, if there is one that I can move on at this time of the evening. Otherwise, I'll pick it back up in the morning. Alright.